Parler de faux je video um, mainly because I'm gonna make something from a rod uh, well you'll, you'll see in a second hold on so this is my bike um, thing in the back, this is a tackle box that I, I showed you guys already. Uh, I just wanted to showcase this thing because this is what I am planning to use when I go fishing sometimes. I don't know like seriously yet, but yeah, I have the tackle box. We recently just made this. We took one of these from Walmart, they're only like $15. We bought one of those. Then we attached some metal to it so that it wouldn't fall this way. So that this one can go sideways so it won't fall sideways. We really put this on the back because I took, because it was too high for me. You know, I'm a short man, boy. So what I'm planning to make is a PVC rod holder for my rod. I'm gonna attach it onto this black thing right here and then put something else there so that it can sit. it'll have a good support we we're gonna choose either PVC or metal but I think PVC might be a, a little bit better because we can cut it more easily obviously uh, just wish I could find it <laughs> what are these days oh here PVC, it's black, so match this. I don't know where to cut it though. We'll just start off here. Fun fact, guys everything in this facility was built by my grandpa. Well, almost everything. Except the house itself. But other than that, 100% built by my G. By my G. Bear with me here, guys. I'm a professional noob. I don't know what I'm doing. This is why I stick to cable. <sighs> so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to sand this with this. I mean file it down with this file here. Just so it looks a bit prettier. He saws the metal like a boss. <laughs> I'm over here I'm figuring how we would put the rod and the PVC onto the bike. So, well, I can't see it here because it's pretty short. So, we're just playing and putting the PVC here on this. It'll come out and we'll pull it right here and stick to this metal and the rod will just sit here. Uh, yeah. I think it'll be. I think it turned out. Oh, 
I think it'll turn out pretty well. I'm pretty excited about it. Yeah, let's go. This camera's about to die, so I'm going to switch it out with the GoPro. Uh, yeah, crazy, isn't it? I have the GoPro on the tripod mount right now. So it's, it's kind of weird, but it's pretty cool. It's so tiny. Uh, so now this is waterproof. Uh, I have this little um, set that I have so I can, I can stick you in. Yeah, Whoops, you got a little wet there. So we're just getting this part fixed. This metal is good and ready. We're putting it on this guard right here. Uh, <coughs> yeah, we're almost done. This is going pretty well. I can't wait to use it. Actually, that... That was so much fun. I kind of want to do it again. So, uh... Sorry, I just had to do it. What's it like down there? <laughs> So on the 